Hi, welcome back to Horn and Fin Outdoors. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make a DIY, fully adjustable, durable, and very inexpensive trail camera mount for you to use with your trail cameras this fall. So follow along, let's check it out, hit that subscribe button, and let's see how we do it. Okay, this is gonna be really quick, easy, and simple. First thing you've got to do is head to your local hardware store, Home Depot, Lowe's, whatever you choose, and you've got to buy the materials. Now make sure that when you go to buy these materials, you buy stainless steel. Uh, it's slightly more expensive than the zinc stuff that's made for outdoors, but stainless steel will last a lot longer than the zinc will. I think all the parts all together for this cost about $5, maybe a little bit less. So it's worth it to just spend a, a a dollar or more to get something that's going to last longer. As far as the parts you need, I'll read the list that I've got for you. It's pretty simple and straightforward. You're going to need a 3 8 by 1 inch bolt, a quarter inch by 3 and 3 quarter inch screw eye, a quarter inch by 2 and 5 8 inch eye bolt, a 3 8 inch neoprene washer, you need three of those, 3 8 by 16 wing nut, a 3 8 by an inch and a quarter fender washer, you need three of those, a quarter inch by 20 wing nut, and a quarter inch bonded ceiling washer. Those items can be changed a little bit, the diameter of the fender washers can be a little bit smaller or bigger, the length of the screw eyes can be a little bit smaller, uh, smaller or bigger depending upon what you're looking for but that's what kind of worked for me to create this, and it seems like it's gonna work pretty good. So let's put it all together now and I'll show you how quick and easy this is. First thing you're gonna do is take the bolt, put a fender washer on it, put a rubber washer on it, and go through the screw eye. And then you're gonna take another fender washer, put it on the bolt, and the, the quarter inch the quarter inch, uh, <laughs> I forget what it's called, the quarter inch one. And then you're gonna do another rubber washer, a fender washer, and your wing nut. Oops, I'm dropping everything here. That part's all together. Then what I like to do is put the Wing nut on upside down, spin it on there, and then this bonded ceiling washer, what that helps do is help secure everything together um, and keep the wing nut from coming loose. And that's it. It's together and that's all you need to do. Now, all you've got to do is go in the woods, screw this into the tree by putting it against the tree and grabbing against the, uh, the other side and just turning it in. It acts as its own handle, it'll twist right into the tree. And then the quarter 20 bolt on the back will screw right into the back of all your trail cameras. And you have a fully adjustable, homemade trail camera mount that you can put together and make for five bucks, I believe. Some people I've seen spray paint theirs. I, I didn't spray paint mine, I'm not worried about it. Sometimes you can use a little bit longer uh, quarter 20 bolt like this one has or a little bit shorter. And again, the fender washer sizes can be bigger or smaller, the rubber washer sizes can be a little bit bigger or smaller. But that's basically all you need to do this. So hopefully, you'll like getting these and putting them together rather than spending uh, nine, ten dollars and buying one off of Amazon. And I wish you guys nothing but tight lines and short blood trails this year.